and welcome back to the channel. So we're having to head back to Hamelin to talk to the prince there, whatever his name is. Uh, to try and see if we could shrink the stones into the wand. Uh, now I'm going to have to walk through the entirety of Hamelin, of course. Look. There's a teleporter here this entire time. Right here. I guess there was one right at the fucking entrance, which I didn't realize. Wasting a minute of my goddamn time. Son of a bitch. We'll have to find that out when we leave. It literally takes a minute to get from the entrance to the fucking palace entrance. Not even the palace, but the entrance of the palace. Fucking ridiculous. I said I will find out whether or not that portal is two way or just the one way. So much shit. Literally, just walking from this room to the other side of the room is literally like the length of what. whatever that little town was called. The first one that we went to. It's nuts. Hello, Prince. Guess what? Your prince, uh, your prince, uh, prince Leonis. We got all them stones. You have Mornstar's uh, magic stones. So you recovered the map from uh, Kublai. That's right, your highness. Well, actually, you kind of gave it to us. Kublai helped you? The sky pirate? He's not a bad soul once you get to know him. He took us under his wing, like, even gave us a dragon to fly about on. The idea. He gave you a dragon? Can this be true? It is it's true, your highness. Tengri helped us find the three magic stones. We couldn't have done it without him. The problem now is, is to, to, to stick the stones back into the monster. And I wouldn't lie to you. We don't have the foggiest. We were kind of hoping you might be able to help us, your highness. Please, give me the wand and the stones. I wish you examined them. Hmm. This is rather tr a tricky one. Oh, don't tell me you, you can't help us either. The stones are just too big, aren't they? Well, if it were me a matter of unifying the sizes of the wands or the stones, my powers would be more than suffice. But I'm afraid that it is not only their dimensions that are out of alignment. There is another problem, one that I lack the ability to resolve. Hang on a minute. Are you telling us that it ain't just the wonky sizes we have to worry about? It's a fl it's never flipping easy, is it? Ah, uh, I f think I've got it. Just think of for a moment. What? When exactly did you, we get hold of Monster? It was when it, we were in the set in the past, which means, um, the problem may stem from attempting to join the Monster of fifteen years past the stone. So you obtained here in the present. As long as there is this time difference, so to speak, it may not be possible to unify, unite them. So we need to find Monsa here in the present? If only it was simple. I had my men search for it, but it seems it has been destroyed. Not a trace of it remains in over our time. Hold on. We brought it with us from the past, so surely it makes sense it doesn't... Uh, exist in the present as well. It's not that. Just get the fucking stones from the past. Jesus. Oh yeah. Ooh, wait, what? Hold on, hold on. This is all getting a bit flipping complicated for me. There may be one who, wait, who can help us. I speak of uh, Kulan. One of, one of the four great sages, her magical powers were the most formidable. I thought the fourth great sage was Oliver's mother. Oh well, whatever. Unless he replaced her. So if we can find the great sage of Kulan, he can help us with Monster. We're talking about Kulan, the queen of the heavens, right? She ruled a city in the clouds called Zan uh, Zanadu. But that place was destroyed, yes. Jeepers, the city was destroyed? 
Can it really be five years ago? Yes, it must be. Five years ago, news reached us to that Shada had attacked the celestial citadel of Xanadud. By the time we mustered our forces, it was too late. When Hamlin's airborne divisions arrived, Xanadu had been wiped from the map. I'm afraid I do not know what became of its queen and her subjects. But perhaps if you were lucky... Bah, a chance. It looks like Shada dealt with them just like he dealt with your predecessor. Swain, please. In any case, it's not within my power to help you. For that, I can only apologize. Don't worry, your majesty. There must be another way. Well, if we can't find Kulan, I guess we'll have to try another great sage. Another? Well, Alicia is no longer with us, which leaves only Rashad. Yes, my father. I should be sure to know something. Your father? Ah, now I see where you get your wisdom. Yes, Rashad you may well be able to help you. Haha, <laughs> thank you, your majesty. Oof. We're not going to find another anything else by hanging ar around here, swapping compliments. Let's be off, shall we? Sure. Let's go find somebody who can help us. They're out there somewhere. I just know they are. Oh yeah, then again, we can't simply go into the past. I kind of forgot about that. This well is a one-time use. Uh, okay. So, we're going to Rashad to help us with the bigger problem than just shrinking crystals. Which is also trying to deal with the fact that there's a time misplacement. <laughs> Hopefully Rashad can help us, because I don't want to be doing this whole run around thing when we're in the final act. Or fast approaching at least. Gosh, look at her. Some point. That's not the type of armor you find around these parts. There's no snout for starters. Hmm. There sure is something strange about her. A P. Hold on. Could she be... Oh, is it Schwein? Is she a friend of yours? I was going to say Schwein. <laughs> uh, yeah, we go way back. But seriously, it's that armor she's wearing. It's what they wore in uh, Xanadu. You what? But I thought Xanadu was destroyed. So she's a survivor, is she? There's Lucky. Come on, Ollie boy. Let's go. For, let's find out what our girl's uh, got to say for herself. Sure, but she's got the glow of P. Mm. Mm. Pale, sign, glowing. Yep. I reckon you're going to need to, to use the spell if you want to chat with this one, Ollie boy. Yep. What do you mean? What? What? Oh, seek fortune. Uh. uh That's right, yeah. <laughs> Never had to use this one before. Can it be? Can you... Can you see me? Of course we can. Why wouldn't we be able to? Oh, this is marvellous. And you could hear me too. Sure, we can hear you. But if you're... Were you, but if we're using spirit medium to speak to you, it must mean... You are correct. I lost my life so much time ago. And you are the first to notice my presence. Well, we weren't uh, going to miss you in that getup, were, were we? So you came here. Uh, you came from Xanadu, did you? Indeed, the Celestial Kingdom of Xanadu was my home. I was charged with protecting our queen. <coughs> but Shadar destroyed Xanadu, didn't he? So I guess you. Um... No, I did not fall in battle. I was. I was slain by a comrade, a fellow citizen of Xanadu. What? Huh? What do you mean? What you said was correct. Trida did intend to lay waste to my home. Oh, indeed, laid waste. The fiend that made uh, the fiend made his way into the inner sanctum of my pa of the palace unnoticed by anyone. But our magic had no effect on him. Even the mighty sorcery of Queen Kulan wasn't useless. Kulan, but we heard she ha had the most powerful magic of all the great sages. 
Nonetheless, it was no it was of no use. She was too powerless against him. But Shada didn't not take in our lives. No, he robbed us of something else. He stole our hats. He took the hats of all who dwelled in our city. He he stole all of your hats? Indeed, and without hats uh, to call our own, we lacked emotion. We lacked reason. And that was how it came to pass that. Uh, you said enough. You said enough. We can imagine what happened then, believe me. Shada will pay for this. What happened that day, I'll never forget. Its horror is forever etched in my memory. It's so horrible to be killed by one of your own people. I'm so sorry. You're not paying me. My people still have hope. Hope? What do you mean? Queen Kulan. Queen of the heavens. She still li She lives still. Huh? She does? But we thought that... No, that I dwell in the spirit realm. I can feel her presence. I can sense my queen's power. For years I've searched for her without cease. But she is not to be found in this kingdom. I sense her presence somewhere in the north, of, to the north of here, but I sense something else too, an evil so terrible I fear to approach it. Ah, yes. North of here? You mean the Tombstone Trail? Hmm, maybe. Time was, there were other kingdoms on this continent, but now there's only Hamelin and the odd town or two. But if she's out there, we have to find her. We got Tengri. If the Queen of the Heavens is somewhere around here, we'll sh we're sure to find her. Do you mean... Do you really ha mean to search for her? You have my internal gratitude. Don't worry, man. We won't let Shadar get away with what he's done. And besides, we have our so own scores to settle with the fiendish scoundrel. I was trying to impress her by your sounding of her uh, for all her own. What he means to say is, leave it to us. I thank you most humbly. I am deeply grateful. Ah, I almost forgot. Should you find Queen Kulan, or any other survivors from Xanadu, would you give them this? It was damaged by the fire that swept out through our realm. It was the only remaining proof that my city, and indeed myself, ever existed. Sure, leave it to us. Wings of Xanadu. That's enough chit chatting for now. It's time to uh, scour uh, Automania and see if we can find the Queen that Kulan. Sure. Is that, even a, is that a badge that's wearable? Damn it. Clearly not. Let's see if this portal actually portals me somewhere. Does. God, I didn't. Oh, I didn't notice it. God, it's right there. You don't. You don't get to see her when you run normally. But the average person's coming here just to fucking get to the other end. Make it a bit more obvious. Not everyone is gonna fucking look around the place up there, tired of walking around. Uh, I guess we got a lot more work than I thought we did. Uh, I ten Greek. Okay. So this is the place. Pedidi, Pedida, 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 Pedida. Oh, okay. Xanadivian guard. Who goes there? Ah, I see you are not from this, these parts. I thought it was actual city in the sky, like Lapita, not fucking just a high mountainous region. How very, how very observant of you. Listen, we'd love to stay in Shad, but we've got things to do. This town has been blessed by the higher power. I cannot allow the likes of you to disturb the tranquility of such a sacred place. Gee, sorry mister, we didn't know, but we're not here to disturb anything. Talk about a warm flipping welcome, this miserable so-and-so could do with some lessons in hospitality from my dear old man. Cease your senseless wittering, witterings, I'll not let you pass. Be gone, 
I have important matters to attend to. The sacred ceremony is about to begin, and Queen Kulan will not be kept awaiting. Hang on, did you just say uh, Queen Kulan? It's her uh, we're after. Ah, just as I thought, you intend to harm our queen. Well, you shall not do so while I draw breath. No, you got it all wrong, mister. We just want to speak to her. Somebody told us that she was still alive. The person who gave us this medal. But, but how? Tell me, where did you find this? Well, we met a lady in Hamelin. She was wearing armor just like yours. Can it be? Is she here now? No. She said she wouldn't travel north. I reckon she had enough on her plate already. Her being dead and all. This... Can it be true? Can she really be gone? It seems our friend here... Oh, it seems our friend here and that mystery woman have some history. Fear she had not escaped, but I cannot allow my feelings to come before my duty. Tell me, what business have you with your, your, the Queen? There's something we need to ask her. I see. Well, I will let you pass, but I'm afraid you may be out of luck. What? You mean we can't see Queen Kulan? I fear she has no time for you now. But did I not say that she was preparing to preside over the sacred ceremony? Time being, take a look around town and see how it blossomed since receiving the blessings of the Queen of Athens. Thank you. Although I was willing to fight you just because of your fucking pers n n assumptions. Okay, you're a guy and all, but you're supposed to fucking talk before just being like, fuck off. Oh, fuck off. Alright, pug fee. How small? I like small. Right, I'm you In case you can. In case. In case you can tell. Oh, hello. How can I help you today? What can I buy from you? Yee. Lazy bone. Give me that. What's this? Uh, truck type intensified. Okay, um. Uh, now, what? Oh, you're already. Come down it. That's insult. Hell yeah, dude. Only got 8,000. <laughs> but I'm poor. So, this um, food I just got is uh, a good food to give my bird. My booty booty. Uh, hmm. Oh, oh, right, nice. But, oh. Oh, please tell me there's new things. Let there be new things. I am in the fucking mountains. You gave me new shit when I was in the water. Can't you unstop those? And all that. You bastard. You fucking bastard. Give me new shit. Already, please. New learns available. Yeah, don't understand half of it. I need to learn the language. Um. Nature stung. Uh, where is it? 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 Where was I thinking? Inside. How do I read this shit? I don't know what. Seems Kulan is a uh, is in Pididia. That's the yeah, other one. Don't worry about. I also saw a pop up as well, something about just bounty or something like that. I don't, don't know what you're just going up for. Oh uh, whatever. I'm annoyed by this game. Based on the fact that I've still not seen any upgrades when it comes to the stamps since I was in fucking that, that water town, whatever you want to call it, I am overly concerned with how much longer is left. We've gone into like five different new regions, not a single one of them gave us a new stamp upgrade. 
it's not even one. Ah, uh, that guy. What is he thinking? Why is he letting more outsiders in? First there was that giant man, and now children. Uh, excuse me, ma'am. We're looking for Queen Kulan. The guard said that she was somewhere around here. Hmm, so you've come to receive her blessing. Here we flip and go again. Uh, here we go uh, flipping again. We're all, what's all this about sacred ceremonies and blooming and blessings? Quiet. You come to Perididia, yet you know nothing of blessings. Look deep into the eyes of the people here, see how we are blessed. Looks like you got trauma through your life and you've seen them right now. We oh, we've seen them all alright. Those people aren't blessed, they're broken hearted. Seems like some blessings aren't worth counting. Okay. What do you mean did what did that man say? Yeah yeah. Our hearts they're broken. Oh no, it was the door doorbell. God damn it. <laughs> um Pay no attention, to Carino. Exerino. I don't. I don't know. Uh, uh, these uh, Spanish or Mexican Latina languages. Well, that's how I'm getting. Um, amiga and amigo. I get sometimes I'm getting which one is for which gender. That's the most basic thing to know. I believe amiga is female, isn't it? Listen, uh, we have received, have uh, lifted the fear from our hearts. Do you know how many hounds in this land have been wiped from the map by the dark Jin? But you can't just give in. You have to stand up to the Jedi. Let me t take a look at you, Nino. Ah, you are a wizard. You are, are you not? Oh, I'm really gassy because of his voice. How can you know what it is to have no magic, no power? Nothing but fear in your heart. But man, you can't let your heart be broken just because it stops you from feeling afraid. He's right. What's the point of being a, of a blessing like that? You may as well have your heart broken by Shada. Hmm. Nina, Parino, it is nearly time for the ceremony to begin. It is finally time for you to join us. It is time for you to be blessed. Uh, I am ready, uh, Yaya. Then let us go. We must not keep Queen Kalan waiting. So what, children not raised broken hearts and then you force it on them? Or is this a fucking cult? I'm not sure, uh, so sure Queen Kalan's going to be, be much help, you know. Or if she's the one handing out these so-called blessings. If we don't do something, that little gill will end up like everyone else. We have to go after them. Yep. The only option. Alright, you old hag. Come here. Making excuses and shit. Oh, what a turn up. There, there, Nina. It will be over soon. There's a good girl, Carino. Yeah, yeah. May we begin the ceremony? Everything is in order, Queen Kulan. It's her! The Queen of the Heavens! We found Kulan! Bad looking too. I've got a bad feeling about this. Get a load of her eyes, will you? They're not, they're all weird. Cheapest. She's half bro broken acid. Shida must have uh, done this when he attacked Zan Zanadu. So now we know why she's been up to no good. And then out these so-called blessings. If we don't do something, Nina will end up broken out of two. No, uh, let me go. What is the matter, my child? I don't want to be blessed. I don't need it. I don't want to be broken out of it. Everyone is uh, he's wrong. Nina. How dare you say such a thing in the presence of Queen Kulan? The child refuses my blessing. Then she leaves me no choice. For the benefit of this misguided girl, a special ceremony is required. Oh, what do you mean to do to her? Oh, what is happening? Oh, what is happening? Whoa. That's not good. 
No, but it's good for us. Void of love. It's a flipping nightmare! What's he gonna do with the poor dog? Nina's in danger. We've gotta save her. Come on, everybody. Right. I mean, it's more than that as well. It's just also we obviously tell that she is possessed. Oh, time for you to get blocked. <laughs> I don't know what the fuck this has I liked. I got big fangs too. Should be able to fuck you up like nothing. Oh, it's attack gone. Roll rain, oh no. I need defense for me. Thank you. No, no pitch black for you. Oh, yes, yes. Give me. Give me that. Ow. No, 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 no. There we go. Oof. I almost lost time. <laughs> but I think it regenerated it. The um, limit. Which is awesome. Not a damage up. It's only with damage, right? Doubles the damage. God damn. I love Griffin. See, easy. <laughs> nice work. All in like three minutes work. Ah, it's very funny level. And I got a wing of sorts. Is that a weapon? Oh, you may have got four as well now. Lovely. Ah, uh, snow blower. Uh, razor like snowflakes tear, tear from the flesh of nearby enemies dealing more to than you. He will get an uh, attack that kills up and rolls forcibly into. You know, swap this. Beautiful. Pixel, this is very Aztecian. Are you all right? Your Highness, get away from me! You disappoint <gasps> me, Queen of the Heavens. Lord Shaddaa! Shaddaa! Where is he? I want to question how she said Lord of the Heavens. Huh? The power of huh? your nightmare is huh? as good as spent. Huh? Though you are a sage, it would seem you are all too human. Perhaps I was wrong to choose you as my representative. Lord Shaddaa, I beg you, give me one more! It is too late. Shorn of the power of your nightmare, what use have I for one such as you? <gasps> Queen Kulan! Huh? huh? Kubla! Kubla. Ha! Sorry Kubla. Okay. <laughs> I see the dregs of Xanadu arrive. How amusing. I look forward to seeing how much of a fight you put up this time. Oh, hell yes, please. Oh, come on. <laughs> fucking edging me with a fucking nice boss fight, and then you just go up and leave. Uh. Do you think Queen Kulan is back to her old self again? Kubla, how dare you? That is a base-born ruffian like you uh, uh, should uh, presume to meddle with the in the affairs of a queen. Ha ha ha! My apologies, Your Highness. I never did know my place, did I? And the same goes for the rest of you. What business can you unruly kind uh, have uh, with one such as I? Charming, isn't she? It looks like the Queen of the Heavens is still very much half broke, broken at it. This looks like a job for you, lad. Can you do the qu for? Uh, can you do for the Queen what you did for Tengri? Sure, I can. I can mend her broken heart. There's no, uh, there's no doubt about it. Why a high of mightiness is missing as far love, and that's what makes the world go round, isn't it? So it's love she needs, is it? Who do we know that's brimming with it? 
If it's love you're after, I'm your man. What? You heard me. No man has more love for a woman than I have for Kulan. You love Queen Kulan? Who Kulan? Oh, going into accent. Never! <laughs> he loves her. He loves her. Now we know. Now we know. <clears throat> <laughs> I like how she gets giddy about, like, love and shit. Enough of this new... Uh, new... Uh, no, God. I know what word it is, but I just got tripped over, over it. Enough of this uh, nauseating talk of love. The very word turns my stomach. Gahaha. <laughs> but speaks uh, the fear, fiery maid, and uh, I fell for this music to my ears. Craggy, you must be love if he's ha happy ta taking that kind of abuse in on the chin. Yes. What's the story between Kublai and Queen Kulan? I need to know. Calm down, will you? Never mind that now. All I need to do no, uh, all I need to know is that Kublai has to share some of the love in his heart with Queen Kulan. Ha <laughs> quite so. Have at it, lad. What was the other thing I took from him? Confidence? I wouldn't be surprised. What do you mean? What do you mean nothing happens? <laughs> Bollocks. <laughs> I hope I've talked to him to take it. The thing that makes the world go round. Thanks again, Captain uh, Kublai. Kubla. Kubla. I keep saying Kublai as well when they literally just said what his name was. I'm an idiot. Yeah. Kubla. Gee, that sure is a lot of love. That should be more than enough. Now we just need to give it an old cool and a lend of it. I'm counting on you, boy. Use your magic to give her my love and bring her back to me. Interesting, though. Queen and a pirate. Don't think I've heard that before. Surprisingly. There's you, Kublai. And Kubla. Sorry, it's become habit. <laughs> I have no need for love from a base-born ruffian such as yourself. You know the drill anyway, shovel uh, shovel that love her way and you, you'll be right as rain. I guess the one thing, forcing love upon others. That's gonna work. I mean, in this case it does. <laughs> How? My, my heart. Hoopla. Your Highness, so you are back with us. I spoke so harshly to you just now. Can you find it in your heart to forgive me? <laughs> Think nothing of it. It was a pleasure to hear such rough and ready words from the mouth of my noble-born lady. Pray do not mock me, Kubla. I'm just glad Queen Kulan's not broken-hearted again. Anymore. Too right. And I must say I'm impressed. With old pirate face by here. That's two servant uh, that's two servants of his heart we've helped ourselves to now. Ah, you're right. It seems as if he, his love for Queen uh, for the Queen is a little bit special. You call me Queen. I am unworthy of such a title. The Skyborn Kingdom of Xanadu was torn from the heavens and cast into the distant ocean. I could not protect my realm. Then I came uh, to this town and broke uh, the hearts of its people. Truly, I am no queen. Hey, Highness, you shouldn't be so hard on yourself. Listen to me. The people of Xanadu saw you as a wise and just ruler. You, uh, you carried out your duties both as a queen and a sage, and trained countless wizards. Have you forgotten all the good you've done? Who that? What you say might be true. But it does not excuse the harm I have caused. I have inflicted so much suffering. Your Highness, we met the ghost of a lady in Hamelin, a soldier who once served you. She was one of the people who died in Xanadu. And she told us that so long as Queen Kulan was alive, there was hope for her people. He spoke of me? He spoke of hope? And look at you around you. The people of this town may be broken hearted, but at least still alive. Your Highness, let us return this town to its former self. 
It may take time, but I know you could do it. Don't know the voice from there, whatever. You may not be queen any longer, but you still stand. I s we still stand beside you. You are not alone. And who's to say you can't rebuild Xanadu? Kubla, Kubla, Kubla. Thank you, thank you, everyone. You are right. Oh, you are right. I cannot give in to despair. I must become something who, someone who can inspire hope in others. That is my duty. You aren't the only great sage who led us astray. My father and Marcuson suffered too. Yes, and Oliver here helped them just like he helped you. And now you're all fighting fit. The battle against evil could finally begin uh, in earnest. Wait a minute. There's something I've been dying to ask. I need to know how long something's been going on, but, uh, going on between Ku Queen Kula and Kubla. I mean, a queen and a sky pirate. It's so it's romantic. Yeah, you have to be so nosy. Kubla is known and feared as the king of the sky pirates, but there is no there is more to him than meets the eye. Gah, uh -huh. quite right. I'm a man of many talents. I end up being the fearless leader of a, ba a band of swashbuckling sky pirates is just one of them. Kubla uh, also served as the commander of the Z Z Zanadovian uh, Airborne Division, in which role he fought for Queen Kulan. Vast, I can speak myself, you slack jawed cur. You were a commander of in Xanadu? Indeed he was. Since the time of the Wizard Wars, Xanadu has avoided conflict. But neutrality cannot be maintained without significant military power. Kublai's forces formed part of that power. Oh, I get it. The lowly servants who ended up holding in head over heels in love with a queen. That's a classic. Swain, do you always have to be so blunt? Yeah, but it's true. I've watched over her since she was but a girl, and I can't say I don't feel for her. But I am a mere soldier, and there's naught can be done about that. Gee, that must be rough. Or tough. But that was then. Things have changed. Changed? Changed how, exactly? Did you not hear my words earlier? I am a queen no longer. There are no ranks and barriers that to keep us apart. Can it be? be? Do you truly mean? I can be quite clear. I have been quite clear. Please do not make me spell it out. I, uh, I... Come on, Kublai, don't be so slow. Lip neck man, tell us out uh, of our misery, don't you? How many times uh, are you going to make out the poor woman say it? I like the fact that this is the moment he's stumbling. A man of confidence and fucking sigma energy. Still, your charring tongues are... Uh, uh, still, your charring tongues are... Cut them off. You stand before the king of the sky pirates. Yeah, all right, all right. The benevolent grace of the Queen of the Heavens hat was unlocked in the story of the Wizard's Companion. New tell the wonder how the little girl became queen. Someone in a cutscene. The hearts of the people of Perdida Perdida have been restored. Also, it's called Perdida, and I was assuming it's a fucking sissy. How much of an idiot am I this episode? Young Nina, uh, you must have been terribly uh, afraid. I apologize most humbly for my actions. Do not worry, Queen Kula. I am happy to, that you have become so kind and gentle. Everything that in Perdida, it's so bright and happy now. We will never give in to Shada. Your words are music to my ears. Truly, child. Truly, children like you are the bearings of help, the hope of a brighter future. We who are old enough to know better chase the path of cowards. All we wanted was to be free of fear, to be protected from the truth. Well, uh, well, yeah, Jesus Christ. That line's kind of profound, I feel. <laughs> well, what, what's done is done, and all that. I just hope that Rotter uh, Shadar's no, not still sta hanging around, oh, waiting for, to pounce, start it, pounce start it, like. 
I know what I must do. My duty is to protect the people of Perdida from Shudan. I vow never to let it, I vow never to let this dark despair engulf this town again. I will make amends for all I have done. Gracias, Your Highness. Then as soon as so I have no choice, I'll throw my lot in with you. Your Highness, we'll protect this puny village together. No Kubla, 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 Kubla. <laughs> Got off the cannon already. There are no other du there are other duties to which you must attend to. It is not only this town yet that must be protected from the dark. How it pulls up. Pal, uh, I think that's a mistypo. Dark pal of Shudas the Sphere, the Paul, I think is supposed to say. With your airship, you may travel freely around our world. Do you understand what it is that I ask of you? Uh, I do. I that only too well. No, but you only just got together. Kubla, for uh, Kubla, though we may be apart, we'll always be together. As long as we shared the same goal. Ha <laughs> ha You're not wrong, your highness. You always didn't have a way with words. Looks like everything's worked out then. Oh, but before I forget. There was a reason we came here and to the middle of nowhere. I'm aware of this. I am aware of this. It says Mornstad, does it not? Indeed. Yes. The shrines were still as power. We did manage to find the three magic stones, but even Markerson can reunite them with the wand. It was beyond Markerson's powers, you say? How could that be? Tell me more. Finally, cutscene. Oh, for fuck. <laughs> well, he speculated that I'm, it might be because we brought Monster here from the past. You know, I'm not getting paid to narrate this, right? These actors could got paid to talk. And yet, I'm doing most of the talking for them. Terribly, in fact. <laughs> Hmm. A masked wizard who can manipulate time itself. I, I am most curious as to what the, his intentions could be. I shall ponder that at my leisure. Our priority is to put a stop to Shadar's plans. I will perform the required ritual without delay. Tidy. Sounds like old Kula Kulan knows uh, what needs doing to get Monster back in one place, huh? This tidy. This handy. Oh, young Oliver. I shall require some assistance in this undertaking. Are you willing to help me? Um, no. I don't want the wand. <laughs> Your Queen Kulan, just tell me what I have to do. A fine response. The ritual must be performed outside. When you are ready, come and see me. I shall be waiting. Thank you, I can end the episode. Jesus, I literally just spoke the entire episode. Yep, yep, yep. Uh, uh, I'm going to leave the episode here, so thank you all for watching, leave a like if you did, subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you in the next video. Keep the faith.